you know, India Yoga's uh, side phrase is be present. And you know, we hear this with Eckhart Tolle, all these kind of new age movements. Really be present means in this life, we only have this vertical moment. Just turn up. If that's in front of a yoga class, be there. Don't have your own preconceptions. If you find teachers you trust, just surrender yourself to them. Let go, be present, turn up, and bring your body into it. Hello, my name is Sri Kumar. Um, I come from Calicut, which is in North Kerala in South India. What I experienced is, you know, I was afraid because I have come as a person who is unfit, who's left his body unconditioned for many years. I thought, you know, perhaps the teachers would, you know, look at all the star Olympic yogis and pay attention to them. But actually that has not been the case at all. Uh, and basically I realized that different yogis are at different stages of their evolution. And that includes me, somebody who's virtually now again a total beginner because I've forgotten a lot of the things I learned many years ago. And I was paid as much attention as, you know, the star students, some of the teachers were practicing. And uh, the, the, the feedback when we're actually on the mat, specific directions and instructions appropriate to me and most importantly, the adjustments they made. That made a big difference because it allowed me to feel what my body should feel like when I go back and practice on my own. So it's been marvelous. I would recommend my soul style classes to anybody who's not got a yoga routine. Um, what's happened at the end is it, it feels like I've got some sort of tailor-made prescription of asanas and a, a, a routine so that I can take home and consolidate what I've learned here. One of the important things I learned is um, through some online classes, I, I'm sure this is not the case with everybody, but I found that a lot of teachers didn't care how I got to a final point as long as I could get there. Whereas here, they didn't care. They were very meticulous about the approach, the build up to an asana, and how, whether I got into the final position or not was immaterial. The, the, the whole journey was emphasized, the emphasis on, you know, being mindful and aware of my core, about technique and about position and, and body awareness. All of these are other things I think that make it absolutely superb. I was a bit surprised when uh, the receptionist told me that I have to stay for a minimum of a month and I wasn't sure why. Now I completely understand because within a month the teachers get to know your body. Each body is different with its own strengths, its own limitations and all of our bodies because of the way we use them they're asymmetrical. So taking all this into account they get to know you and they can prescribed from a whole series of asanas. Some schools focus only on maybe a dozen asanas. I mean, these guys seem to have hundreds. And uh, yeah, I, I felt I was pushed. I will confess I didn't always like it, but always I trusted them and it was really good for me. From the first day, you know, I had a, a feeling I would like it. Um, the first couple of days was fine, but of course then as I began to push my body, I discovered I had muscles that I never knew existed. So I've had a lot of body ache and I was kind of hoping it'll go away within the first one or two weeks. But actually my breakthrough has been in the last week. But despite that, I can feel when I bend, when I flex, uh, there's a lot of difference. So, uh, you know, I wanted to come before I had developed a problem. And uh, one of the main things I've noticed actually is even the way I walk is different. There's more of an engaging of my core abdominal muscles. 
I feel a little bit more upright. So I think that's been very satisfying for me. Find a teacher. Don't try and do it out of a book. I tried to do it out of a book from, you know, and I was taught many years ago, but my body is now very different to when I was taught. So it's kind of ridiculous. Maybe online classes work for some people, but I think coming here for a month, if you can invest that much time for yourself as a priority, I think, you know, if I'd come 20, 30 years ago, it would have been much easier. So if you're young, you know, don't wait until you're, you know, fat and old like me. That's my recommendation.